Hey, hello and welcome everyone. Welcome to today's video. And in this video, we are going to talk about how to get rid of multiple mouse when you are having multiple computers that you are shuffling your work with between. So in my last video, I already uh, showed you how I got rid of the multiple keyboards. So I switched to this multi-device keyboard from Logitech, which helps me uh, switch between my desktop and laptop and other devices just in the click of uh, these buttons here. So, but I'm still uh, using these two mouse to shuffle between my laptop and desktop. So I need to get rid of this setup. And for that, I will be using this mouse. Uh, this is a multi-device uh, mouse from Dell. And uh, we will be talking about the complete feature and specification. And we'll go through the unboxing process for this uh, mouse. Okay, so let's get started. Okay guys, so let's start the unboxing process. So this is the mouse that we are talking about today. This is a Dell multi-device mouse. The model number is MS5320W, as you can see here. So let's open up the box. So this is the form factor and you can see there are three device options and on the bottom you have a click button on which you can switch between the three devices. The scroll wheel comes with three action. You have a click in the center and then a left and right option that you can configure. And in addition to this, you get two programmable buttons. So you can use the Dell peripheral uh, software to program these buttons and you can use this for say browser forward backward action and you, you can uh, configure it as per your wish. Let's go inside and see. So here is the Dell Universal Receiver and then you have the battery slot that you can see here. And uh, so let's check out for the battery in the box. Yeah, it is there. So let's pull this off. So the form factor is quite nice, quite ergonomic. It comes uh, fully in the palm. And uh, let's check out for the instruction manual. So here it is. So on the front we have just the instructions to uh, plug in the battery and power on the mouse. And on the back you have the instructions to connect to the various devices. And this is the link given here for the software. Okay, so let's check out the mouse. So I am connecting it with my desktop first to which I have plugged my universal receiver and on clicking on the button first device gets connected and which is my Mac mini. So here you can see the device is working fine. The mouse is working fine with my Mac mini and now I will switch by clicking the button to connect to my next device that is my Dell laptop. And for my Dell laptop, I am actually connected via the Bluetooth. And uh, here you can see that uh, this Dell Peripheral Manage Manager software uh, that is uh, for my Dell laptop. It is already pre-built into my laptop, so it got uh, initiated as soon as I uh, switch to my next uh, my next device from my mouse. And you can use this Dell Peripheral Manager to configure your uh, mouse button so for example here the uh, scroll mm, wheel uh, has a click action on the center and left and right uh, click action as well so all of those uh, events you can configure using this software as you can see here and uh, in addition to the central buttons you have the side buttons which are again programmable so you get all the option to configure these buttons so this is my setup earlier. You can see here that I have two keyboards, two mouse to connect to my laptop and my desktop. But uh, now that I have used this uh, multi-device keyboard and mouse, I have actually removed that clutter from my uh, desk. Uh, 